You are alive. Hello. So we've been wanting to do some camp showcases. And uh, this is one of my friends in the game. He has an awesome spaceship. And I'm going to shut up and let him walk you through it. I'm just going to follow along. But look at that. That is so cool. You like to check my ass, right? Uh, well, I was looking at your spaceship, but yeah, you got a great booty. <laughs> so, the arrow is pointing up, so I think, uh, yeah. Oh. Not a success. Still not a success. Aha! There you go. Three times this charm, I think. So he uses the symptomatics to teleport inside his UFO. Very cool. So, uh, over here you have uh, a small cockpit with uh, the Alistair uh, outfit over here. One of the scoreboards rewards from uh, last year, I think. And over here you have... Uh, oh, I even did uh, this play on yeah. It did sell it. I like that skin, it looks cool. Uh, yes, there is not much to tell you how the camp looks like, but I think you... Yeah, the tour is... It's, 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 I think it's hard for this camp, no? But... Uh. Oh, hello! It's a badass camp. There was a lot of time and effort that went into this. He did a really good job. And this is Darwin's evolution. You start as a Windigo, and a Mire Lurk, and a Scorched, and a Cricket, and you turn into a Flatwoods monster, and an alien. And then a Yagwai. <laughs> uh, he did a really good job on this camp, though. I've been wanting to show other people's builds. Voice module online. Audio functionality test initialized. And I like how he did the cockpit area. This is really cool. Please take a seat in uh, my toilet, mate. I still have some space left. Yes, and aliens, they have a very unique toilet system. Um, you can just jump right in here and then use the bathroom. The bubbles are no air. They are something. That's good to know. I always come over into his camps and then pee in his hot tubs, so... Yeah, very cool camp. Peaceful also. Not uh, a lot of uh, enemies around. If you check the map, it's uh, in the middle of the white spring. Uh, but no enemies. At least uh, you build in the sky. I'll show you on the map where his camp's located at. And a lot of the higher level players may know this, but um, 
here, hop up real quick. Let's show them the symptomatics. So the symptomatics, I have yet to use these in my camp. But the way it works, you have one where the symptomatic is inside your camp. And that's the one that we teleported up through the bottom and into the camp. To get out, Ah, that was not a question. I thought you said to me, get out. <laughs> you look down onto the symptomatic and it'll give you an option to use it. And since it's on the outside of the camp, it lets you outside. I've really been wanting to do a build that incorporates the symptomatics. I just haven't gotten to it. But very cool camp. A lot, a lot of time in that. Two years old, mate. Also dead. <laughs> well, if it's a good camp, you know, you don't want to, don't want to waste it. No, 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 no. There is also an upstairs, but there is not much, I think, to see. Uh, is it going in my generator? Yeah, but it's late. It's one of the only uh, suitable uh, generators, I think, on this spot. It's big, but... No, this is the... That was definitely the best option. It fills uh, the empty hole a little bit. Very cool, though. Thank Top you for down. watching. Have a nice day. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> uh, that's an awesome camp. You know what's more awesome, mate? You! <laughs> You're a bad liar. <laughs> but yeah, we'll be showcasing some more stuff. Ah. Thank you. I, I agree. I think he did a really good job. So, we're going to go ahead and upload this on our YouTube. If you ever want to check us out, it's Fallout 76, a broken community. Fallout 76, open community? A broken community. Broken community. Yep. You want some right, stamp packs or that. database? I'm a little bit too happy. All right. Till next time, when we uh, upload our, our next camp. We'll see you then.